Hi everyone, and welcome to the Birthday Workbook Seminar Series, part of the Birthday Collective. My name is Chris, and today we will be looking at the topic Children, Competition and Sport. In this seminar, we will look closely at 9-year-old Ted Chan's experience as a competitive swimmer. His essay is taken from the Birthday Book Junior, a collection of essays about Singapore by 54 children mostly 5 to 13 year olds from various walks of life. At this juncture, I would like us to pause for a bit and consider the following questions. Namely, did you play a sport competitively as a child? And if so, how was the experience enjoyable and meaningful for you? So take some time now to discuss these reflection questions with your friends to get a conversation going. If you're in schools, you might want to raise these questions to your teachers and also hear their experience as well. Everybody has a story to share and it will be interesting to learn from each other how we perceived our sporting experience when we were younger. I remember swimming competitively as a child, uh, though I don't quite remember it being very enjoyable. Uh, I think it was meaningful because my parents constantly told me that it was a life skill I should have. Um, I think swimming competitively uh, was pretty painful at times, <laughs> uh, but nonetheless, I thought it was a useful activity to keep me fit. Uh, I was quite a plum boy, you see, so I guess swimming competitively helped to um, keep me active. <laughs> something that I haven't been having, uh, something that I haven't been doing very much um, since growing older. Anyway, coming back to this, uh, please watch the following video about young gymnasts in China. What do you think is the message of the video? And later on, when we read the essay, ask yourself the following. To what extent does the article support, challenge, or qualify the message of the video? The link to the video is found on the screen, so you can click on it and come back to this seminar later. This is the link to the article that we'll be looking at in greater detail, so please click on it and we will look at the following questions after you've read the article. Assuming you, that you have read the article, please consider the following questions. Firstly, the writer begins his essay with a quotation attributed to himself. Why do you think the writer begins his essay in this way? Secondly, how do you think the writer began swimming competitively? Identify a word from the third paragraph to support your answer. Next, the writer states that he has come to love the excitement and focus of competitive swimming. What might this reveal about the nature of passion? The writer states that all I know is swimming competitively means that I must train very hard many times a week. Does this undercut his mother's claim about the benefits of swimming? Why or why not? What are some different life skills and lessons that the writer might have learned from swimming? Support your answer with specific references to the essay. Lastly, what conflicting emotions does the writer feel when he sees his friends playing and enjoying themselves? Why does the writer experience these conflicting emotions? So feel free to submit your responses and answers to the birthday workbook at gmail.com. We are very excited to listen to you and to read your responses. So once again, this is the Birthday Collective, the Birthday Workbook Seminar Series, and I am Chris. Till the next time, see you.